our roof is not going to have a single screw or a single bolt attaching it to the hull. It's pretty much going to be floating on there with these. Can you believe how much time flies? It's been one year since we sailed our little empty sailboat to the south of Brazil to complete our sailboat restoration project. And we've had the privilege of putting our creativity to the test. This is Luke, and I'm Lori, and we're still at it. <laughs> Thanks to our Patreons and viewers like you. Now, if you want to see us finish what we started, subscribe to our channel, like this video, and ring that bell. It's a totally free way to keep the journey alive. But before we get to this, we want to show you a few other things that we're building in our Viber to make it the perfect place to relax after a long day. There are so many little details to complete on our boat. And to maximize the space, Fernando is starting to build us a hanging cabinet in our Viber to take full advantage of the extra headroom. After all, you can never have enough storage. Fernando around right now and I'm trying to figure out what he's doing in order to make our uh, cabinet that goes in the V berth. He's there. All the materials here. But I still can't figure out what he's doing. Um, I'm sure it all makes sense and I'll be able to explain it to you soon. Fernando finished this amazing cabinet that we have in our birth and it's almost done not quite there's a little finishing touch that need to be added like we're gonna finish this up so it's level also the door is gonna be level as well and of course we have to put up that little piece on the top to call it a day we also need to buy a very tiny piston because we have this large piston and it is way too hefty for this so we need to get it tiny tiny one so that when we open it it doesn't have to be supported and I think it's great look at the size it's looking pretty good so inside our beaver there is a little nook on either side where you can sit against the bulkhead and relax so what can you do and what can you make all of the comforts of home to be here maybe put a light here a fan a charger and have a little shelf where we can plug in our phone, read a little book. What else can we do with this little tiny corner? This is what we want to build here.
bit of a dilemma when it comes to this forward part of the bow in the V birth, and that is this little inspection hatch that we have. Um, it is not something that we're going to be using on a regular basis. It is really just for inspecting that part of the bow, which is below the anchor locker, and it's not even really good for storage, but it is something that we will have to access every now and then. So that is creating a little bit of a monkey wrench when it comes to us finishing this rebirth quickly about a lot of ideas about just creating separate pieces that we could remove like we could remove the front and the bottom blah blah blah, blah. but it became a little bit cumbersome because particular of this corner right here that comes really close to the hull so we came up with this idea that we're gonna make this part one unit that we can have like handles here and we can remove this entire piece and access it because it was really the angle of the door opening that was causing the biggest problem. The album was Palabras Finais. Conseguimos? Ah, que positivo! <laughs> Our roof is not going to have a single screw or bolt holding it on to the hull. It's pretty much going to be floating using these. now and he's making these little forms of wood now I don't really know what the name of this is called so if you do let us know but this is actually going to fit perfectly into the little L of the frame on the roof of the superstructure and this is going to be held in by pressure so when he inserts this it's going to be pushed as far as forward and then there's going to be like a key held in the back like a, a trim if you will that will be holding all of this forward and it will be holding with pressure so this is the way he's resolving how to figure out how to create a roof without drilling tons of holes in our still boat especially since we painted it so so far it's looking pretty good but see how he's put this together really simple right Let's see if it works.
think it's gonna work. All right, I'm beat. I know the guys are beat. It's been a long week for us and they got a lot of little stuff done. It's surprising that all of these little things actually take a lot of time, all these detail-oriented things and all these weird angles. Uh, we got our roof done. We got our cabinet in. We got our idea for this. Uh, hatch cover in and it's been good just a lot of little futzing to go over here still we finished our uh, little niches but we still have to put our little shelf in and of course we've got our lead lights gonna go in eventually so there's a lot of stuff to go but for now we're gonna rest see you next week